Hey Petapinchers, Happy New Year to everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is your glamorous Petapinchers, Shalomi, and today I'm coming to you with my after Christmas winter living room refresh. So if you want to see all the items and how I put them together, you know what to do. Just keep on watching. So to start off, I'm going to walk over to the windows. And as you can see, I usually have the white uh, curtains here, but I have kept some of the ones that I used for Christmas. And these are the K-Gorge velvet black curtains. And I think they make a very beautiful statement in this space. Moving down to my chairs, I have changed the pillows. And these are some beautiful lumbar pillows that I picked up at William Ashley about three years or so ago. And it's really tying into the whole um, palette that I'm going for, the look I'm going for with um, the grays, the blacks, and the whites. In the center here, everybody knows my DIY clock table I'm using this black vase. This was um, kind of like a iridescent vase that I spray painted black and I just absolutely love the way it looks and I all I have in there are my foxtails and the same goes for the other chair. My two chairs here came from Wayfair. I got them about two years ago and it just works absolutely beautifully and perfect with my space. Now we're gonna move over to the sofa. And as you can see guys that this year for my winter look i'm really just keeping it clean and elegant and that is why i've incorporated the black i had these black pillows on the sofa at christmas with some pink ones but i decided to keep them and just add the grays and whites to them i just like i said i want to keep it elegant simple and beautiful so my white sofa here, if you've been with me for any time, this sofa was thrifted from Facebook Marketplace and it just absolutely looks like it's always been here. I love this piece, very elegant and it's more of a velvety material. And as you can see, it has the nail heads going down the front on both of the arms and at the very base off the chair and it matches these ones that I picked up from Wayfair. So that was one of the reasons why I chose the Wayfair chairs because I kind of want it to be um, cohesive. On my sofa here are these beautiful pillows. These black ones, like I said, I had them on for Christmas. These are actually pillow covers from um, Amazon and I just absolutely love the um, texture beautiful very wintry very cozy absolutely gorgeous and these um, fluffy ones these I've had these since I started my channel and I go back and forth a lot as to whether I should get rid of them or or not but what it sure does it provides that airy feeling that I'm always trying to accomplish with um, you know, making the space look a little bit lighter. So, very shaggy. Everybody has these. But I think I'm going to keep them for a while and see what happens. This beautiful center pillow I picked up at HomeSense as well. It is absolutely gorgeous. The beading is just phenomenal. Um, I have been trying to find the other one for it, like to make it a pair. I have been to several home sense stores and just haven't been successful in finding it. So I'm using it as my um, center pillow for this look and I just absolutely love it. On the other side, matching pillows looks the very same with the um, black textured and the furry white one. 
and then this throw is absolutely gorge this too also came from home sense you would have seen this uh throw in my pillows and throws video i will link it for you either in an icard or in the description box that way you can take a look at that video to see all of the um, pillows and throws that i collected Directly above the sofa is my mirror. This also came from HomeSense. And I've always had this mirror here. I haven't changed it over the years. I just, I just love it. And it works very well in the space. Now moving over to my coffee table, this is a statement piece. And I have gotten so many questions on this table where I got it, where I bought it. This piece was also, as a lot of you already know, this was another marketplace find and I've had this table now for, to be honest, maybe six or seven years. It is just absolutely gorgeous and I just love it. On top of that, I have the silver tray. This tray came from HomeSense maybe three years ago. And within the tray, I have this cute little uh, vase with white roses. Um, the vase came from HomeSense. Again, almost everything, guys, um, that I have comes from HomeSense. And these beautiful uh, white roses, believe it or not, came from the thrift store. Just beside that, I have my Thompson Ferrier candle in this elephant container. It smells amazing. And then I have these three candle stands and this I purchased, I think sometime in the fall. And these three, they also came from HomeSense. And I have just added these white or off-white flameless candles to the top of it. Okay guys, since it's been a while since I have uh, posted a video, I'm going to give you a bonus here. Um, just on what my dining room looks like at the moment. Again, as you can see by the windows, I have the black velvet K-Gorge curtains. And what I did was I got six pieces and all six pieces were um, over there in the living room as a backdrop to the Christmas tree. So I took some pieces out and just carried it into the dining room just so that it flows a bit. Now this might be one of the very few times that you see my table with without a table setting, without a tablescape. But like I said, for this um, winter, I'm going really simple, really elegant. So on top of the table, I have this tray that I picked up from yeah you got you guessed it from home sense simply gorge mirror on the bottom and i've just added these two candlesticks again from home sense about two years or so ago and then i also added this beautiful orchid from home sense you got it so guys like i said simplicity and elegance is what i'm looking for or I'm looking to do this year. And I am just already loving the way it's light, airy, clean. So um, I'll see what I do for the um, spring season. But for now, this is what we're doing. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay guys, I have moved the chairs back a bit, that way I can show you the base of the table. I know that I have a video um, on me 
putting the table together but just wanted to show you the base again for those of you who missed that video this table is absolutely like it's just spectacular and i love that base beautiful elegant and just right up my alley um, again i have a lot of questions on the table as to where i purchased it and um i purchased it from a local furniture store in my city for those of you who are just joining me i live in toronto so um just a local store they don't have like a link per se that i can add to the video nor do they ship um outside of canada i've had so many questions on it i asked the um one of the store clerks if they ship and it was a no the chairs are these beautiful gray chairs with the door knockers on the back and then you see i have the beautiful um, nail heads going all the way down another thing i like about these chairs is that it has the um the legs like the silver legs goes very well with the base off the table now this table did not come with these chairs but the chairs that um it it kind it came with i didn't like them so i switched them out for these chairs and one of the reason being is when i sat on it it was hard as rock hard as a rock so i was like no thanks i'll choose my own chairs and they um, allowed me to kind of go in and you know choose whatever I wanted to pair with it and I think these just absolutely go perfectly with it okay guys and that is all I have for you today thank you so much for joining me I truly do appreciate you clicking on this video and if this is your first time seeing my channel welcome 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 I really do appreciate you stopping by and would love for you to consider staying by hitting the subscribe button below and make sure you hit that notification bell also. That way you are the first to know when the Glamorous Penny Pincher uploads new videos. And to all my lovely Penny Pinchers, you know how I feel. Nothing has changed. Love you, love you, love you. Until the next video, this is your Glamorous Penny Pincher Shalomi saying bye-bye.